What's up, people? I'm Michael, and I'll be teaching you how to use the new 2010 iPod Shuffle. Okay, so first of all, there will be a little switch right here, right there. And the first one that you can switch it to will be just songs in each playlist, okay? Like that. And then you can switch it to shuffle, like that. And then, on your headphones, you will have this thing right here, okay? And, try to get it up closer. Okay, well, it should have a plus and a minus sign on it in the middle button. Okay, so, this is what you use to browse through your songs. If you want to go to the next song, you have to double click this middle button right here. And if you want to go to previous, you got to triple click it. To make the volume higher and lower, you have to press the plus and the minus on it. And to hook your new iPod up to the computer, you gotta take your USB and your little plug, and you gotta stick it into the iPod where the headphones normally go, and it'll look like this. Then you just stick it into your computer, and a screen will pop up and telling you to set up your iPod and everything, and you gotta do that. Also, there is a thing where you can see how much battery you have left. What you would do is you'd have your iPod off, turn it to the middle button, and then switch it off and back on really quickly. Okay, and then this little dot light will appear right there. Let me do it for you. See, that? that's the light that'll come on. Okay. And there's also some more stuff like if you want to hear the song that you're playing, you can hold this middle button down until you hear this person start talking and tell you the name of the song and the artist. And if you want to hear the playlist that you're on, you got to hold it down until you hear a beep. And once you hear the beep, it'll tell you playlist one or playlist two. Okay? Thanks for watching, and I hope you learn how to use your iPod Shuffle.